Good day! In this video, we will teach you how to properly use a fire extinguisher by using the PASS method. When a fire breaks out at your workplace, please follow these three steps. Step 1. Check to make sure that the fire extinguisher you have on hand is the correct type of extinguisher to extinguish the type of fire. Type A is used for ordinary combustibles such as wood and paper. Type B extinguishers are used on flammable liquids like petrol and oil. Type C is for electrical fires so they can be used on faulty outlets and appliances. Type D is used on combustible metals such as magnesium, titanium, sodium, etc. Step 2. With the extinguisher in hand, step 2 to 2.5 meters away from the fire. Step 3. Use the PASS method to put out the fire. P. Pull. Pull the pin so that you are able to discharge the extinguisher. A. Aim. Aim the extinguisher nozzle at the base of the fire. S. Squeeze. Squeeze the lever to discharge the extinguisher agent. Releasing the lever will stop the discharge. S. Sweep. Pointing the extinguisher at the base of the fire, move the extinguisher from left to right or back and forth in a sweeping motion until the fire is out. When the fire is out, continue to watch the fire to ensure the fire does not ignite once again. If the fire starts again, repeat the pass method. Let's recap on the pass method. P. Pull the pin. A. Aim. S. Squeeze. And S. Sweep. Pull the pin, aim, squeeze and sweep. Special precaution to keep when fighting a fire. 1. Call emergency services immediately if the fire is beyond your control. 2. If you feel that you cannot put out the fire safely, exit the building immediately. 3. Don't ever use water to extinguish a fire on electrical equipment, flammable liquids or combustible metals. 4. Never obstruct access to fire extinguishers. 5. If you have not been trained in firefighting, seek help immediately. Remember, fires can be harmful and fatal, so do not put the fire out yourself unless it is safe to do so. At Nedbank, your safety, my safety, our safety is our collective responsibility.